Hello, rising to you all. You already know what we finna get into. We finna get into these messages and see what our Elohim wants us to know at this time. We finna get into these messages and see what our Elohim wants us to know at this time. Excuse me, y'all. My car is all bent up, okay? I don't work these mugs out. <laughs> so. Let's see what our other home wants us to know at this time. Seven of Swords. Somebody trying to um call they sub somebody 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 think that they can sneak away or run away from their judgment. You can't. You have to answer for what you did. You somebody think by sneaking away or running away that they can run away from their judgment and things just gonna clear up no that's not how it go what you did to go against individuals or an individual you're gonna get karma for You gave abundance to get some type of magician work done to cause burdens and stress to people. So you can't take action to lie, betray people, be an enemy, do underhanded shit, and then think you're going to run away from your judgment and things coming into balance. That's not how it works. You are going to receive your karma. Things are going to change for you and maybe even your abundance. You should have thought about that before you decided to. Before you decided to. Because this is you handing something to a magician for them to do something. For you de for you deciding to do this. You put the money in this magician's hand. So what you thought because you put the money in a magician's hand that, okay, I put the money in their hand. I ain't actually do the work or whatever the case may be. So cool. I'm cool. No, that magician and you not cool. You were watching this magician uh, try to cause endings for people or cause endings for people. This could have been somebody that you could have traveled towards, traveled with, or somebody that you could have spoken to from another country or something. You did all of this to cause people loss to their stability, <laughs> upset people, and... You were even trying to make sacrifices here on people. Now you want to run away from it? No, that ain't how that go. Now you, you thought you was boss. Now you want to retreat. But no, continue to be thoughtless and careless like you were. Because now you're about to get stripped. This is the direction that you are headed towards. 
Because what you communicated and what you planned and the risk that you took, sir, So you can't run away from it. This masculine could have Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, highly aspected in his chart. Sagittarius, Pisces, Aries, Cancer. Highly aspected in his chart. You can't run from that. What's that scene? Um... What's that movie? It was like a parody that, um, it was a parody who did the Marlin, uh, brothers did. Um, It was like making fun of all of the hood movies. Yeah, look, what he was doing here and stuff, and you thought it was here and what you was doing, but it's not. What I was going to say? Don't stop drinking your juice, something in South Central. Remember that hood funny parody movie? Yeah, you was tennis swords and people trying to lay them to rest here. Trying to completely ruin people and have them at dead ends and you trying to run. Ain't that some shit. But, um, <laughs> remember that scene where he was about to mess with that woman in that mail truck and then he tried to run and get away? And she was like, you ain't going nowhere. Because that's what's going to happen to you because you ain't going nowhere. You have to answer for your spiritual crimes. Somebody might end up hurt in a hospital here. A Scorpio. Queen of Cups here. Or a Capricorn or a Virgo. See, you tried to get your abundance from the devil here. Something was very karmic. Um, not only that, you try to lay to rest and cause death to a Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, with Capricorn or Virgo in a chart for abundance. You try to sacrifice somebody for abundance, your own selfish, complete happiness. Hmm. And you're trying to run away from the chaos that you caused. Nah, get back here, good buddy. Get get on back, uh, like off of uh, Mortal Kombat. Get over here, because that's what's going to happen to you. Because this is what you wanted for somebody else. And if you was working with a feminine, possibly a Scorpio, a Virgo, or a Capricorn, they might end up in a hospital sick or pass away too as well. But you were trying to have a Queen of Cups, another Queen of Cups be a sacrifice so that you can get abundance for your own complete happiness and your own selfish reasons. And you caused a lot of chaos here, a lot of instability. And you think, guess who coming to balance out? The divine. You wanted the divine to be at a loss, but now you about to be at a loss. Five of cups, five of swords, nine of swords, eight of swords. You, ooh, four of cups. You're going to regret what you did when you experienced this tower. King of Cups, you could be a Scorpio. Yourself, you, you could be, you could have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio in your chart. Aries, Sag, Virgo. You and your hoe.
you and your hoe, who you, whoever you was in some form of um, partnership with, and whoever this King of Wands is, because this might not even be you. All of y'all about to meet a tower for what y'all did in the past. Y'all did this to have a new endeavor. Y'all partnered up and did some bullshit. So, here come the bullshit. So, get y'all ass right back over here. And y'all gonna answer for y'all spiritual crimes that y'all did against another. And or physically. And it's the scorpion when they say get over here with this Scorpio energy coming out. Yeah. Yeah, you gonna meet that tower. <laughs> you ain't getting away with it. You finna grieve. You f you're it's an empty victory as well. You could be in a panic or whatever the case may be, but you're going to be deeply unhappy and you're going to be confined spiritually and or physically. You're going to purgatory. Or you're going to jail and you're going to regret what the fuck you did. So ain't, ain't no, ain't no walking away from this because this is getting balanced. Reciprocity. See what you gave out. See you, you gave things out. So now you're going to give, now you're going to get some things, you know, balance. So don't run away before you can get what you need to get. Hmm. Don't run away before you get what you need to get. Because it ain't just this Ten of Cups, Nine of Pentacles that you thought that that was the only thing that you was going to get for trying to make sacrifices on people and do shit to people. Spiritually and or physically. You thought that you could cause chaos in people's lives and then run your punk ass off? No. That ain't how this go. You, you wanted to play, you wanted to play in spiritual things. You wanted to play with immortals. So now it's time to play. It's Mortal Kombat now. And you finna get snatched right back. To where you caused the suffering of others. See, you thought you ran away and was home free, but that's the point. For you to think that you are all right after what the fuck you did. And now you about to get snatched. You're about to get snatched. You and whoever else, you are about to get snatched. Yeah, you wanted a goddess energy at a loss. A badass being full of life, love, and possibilities. You wanted them in the five of cups. So you gifted, so you gifted witches and shit. To ten of swords, this person. But it was an empty victory here. These people that you called on are no match for the supreme ruler. Or the sun. Okay, because he's very gifted in them attacks. In them battles. He know your plan before you even, he know the opportunity that you want to take before you even fucking take it. And you thought you was just going to persevere and go on and walk away, huh? You and this woman and this other man. And whoever else you was working with. You thought you was just going to let go. And who? 
after you tried to have people at a dead end, after you placed money in hand to voodoo priests and priestesses, you thought, cool. It's all good. Hmm. These attacks that you called in, they coming back. And it's the now you're going to be under attack and you're going to have to go through battle. You're going to have to have the strength to persevere through the things that you had planned for others. And you thought you was just going to walk away and let go and everything was going to be good and, and balanced and shit. You celebrated too. You definitely about to get dragged back. You thought you was just finna have you a new life and listen, you thought you was finna kick it after trying to sacrifice people. Ain't that some shit? You kicking it and hunky dory why why the people that you inflicted shit on is at a loss. You gonna regret all of these fucking partnerships. And people are going to regret celebrating with you and forming partnerships with you because that karma that you're going to get is going to rub off on their ass too. Because it looked like other people um, was in on this as well. Other people was in on this as well. See, the divine will let you do that. Let you get so high. Let you think you just. <laughs> mm, mm, you home free. So when that loss comes, you going to feel it. When that loss comes, you're going to feel it. Five of cups again. So when you have to grieve, you're going to feel it. Five of swords, empty victory, defeat. All this deception is coming to an end with the world card. Four of swords being laid to rest. Somebody might even get laid to rest. There's definitely going to be some dissatisfaction here. And don't think by you trying to partner up with somebody that um, you tried to do this to that it's going to get you off because it's not. Because that's what it looked like too. Yeah, that, this, that shit is blocked to a sword. So you might as well not even try to take the risk with your hidden intention. You might as well not even try to take the risk with your hidden intentions, honey. Because it's not going to save you. And whoever this witch is that you um hired or and or dealt with. They gonna get drained out themselves here. They're gonna be in a three of swords for all that hard work that they put in. They under judgment now. They under judgment now. They're going to suffer unhappiness trauma heartbreak they're being evaluated now why they bullshitting they being evaluated now and it's a decision being made on their life what's gonna happen for them next so you think that if this 
practitioner and or whoever you was dealing with, if they get in karma and they under judgment and the announcement of the decision is being made upon them, what the fuck you think is going to happen to you? You think you finna run away from it? No. This person thought that they can escape too. <laughs> Two of wands, eight of cups, five of wands. They thought they can escape too. That was nothing but ego. They thought they was going to escape with the bag. And be good. <laughs> Doing this sneaky spiritual shit. Nope. You know how they have them dead end streets? That's just basically what you went down. Being greedy and money and power hungry. That's what you went down. Doing this spiritual shit. It's like a dead end street. Yeah, you was thoughtless and careless here that you didn't even realize that you just tied yourself up into some shit. And this is the truth. Ace of Swords. Yep. And it's the end of a cycle to your abundance and you gifting people for bullshit here. So you can expect the unexpected with your opportunities and abundance here. Yeah, you was definitely attacking people trying to, um, you was working hard, felt like what you was doing was efficient to triumph over people by attacking them here. And you made an offer on somebody who is connected to a higher power. You also tried to make an offer out of some type of guilt, but you acted remorseful, but there was still some form of greed. There was still backhandedness in whatever this is. And you were persistent in what you was doing. So whatever this judgment is, it's going to be persistently on your ass and whomever else ass. So don't run away yet. Don't don't run away just yet. Good buddy. Come on back. Come on back. Come on back now. Y'all demonic asses, they thought that y'all can just fuck with somebody because y'all thought that they was just mortals but no they were chosen chosen so we finna run that back We got to run that back. Get over here. Get over here. You hear it? And it got 93 likes on it. The divine gets the victory. 
flawless victory on y'all asses. In all, in all your ways acknowledge him and he shall direct your path. Praise Yahweh from whom all blessings flow. <laughs> Yahshua is not only a remedy for your weariness and trouble, but he will give you an abundance of the contrary, joy and delight. So things are coming into balance for the people that these people inflicted to as well. I hope you all got a message from this read that will help you along your journey. Know that Yahweh loves you. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you all later. Peace.